Uh, hello? Hello, hello, hello? Can you all see? Can you all hear? How are you doing today? Hype. Hype is the name of the game. I'm excited. It's been a very hype, hype day today. We had the finale of Hawkeye. We watched a new Matrix movie. Uh, we watched the finale of, uh, of Witcher season two. We've been getting a lot of, trying to get ahead for the holidays so we can have some time off, but. And now, finishing Mass Effect two. So it's very, very, very exciting. All right, um, I ended a little early last stream, but this time we're going to the end. Um, and I should say, I, I don't know how long it's gonna take, but going to the end of the main game, it's possible I don't get to do all the side missions. And we'll see uh, how we are in terms of doing the uh, arrival. But yeah. Uh, I'm really excited, I've been looking forward to this all week. Anyway, uh, guys, I know that we're getting towards the uh, the end of the game here, so I'm probably going to be interacting with chat even less than I normally do, which is not all that much. If you see me looking over, it's mostly to make sure that there's not some type of static audio buildup or something, you know, isn't going completely haywire, but that's going to be pretty much all I do, is just kind of looking over, making sure people aren't going crazy. But if they are, just make sure you try to get my attention by spamming audio problem or something like that, okay? So, uh, I'm, uh, really excited. <laughs> okay, uh, we're gonna be throwing on some audio here. Hopefully the audio's good for everybody. You guys can let me know. We're gonna get started. Mass Effect 2. Resume. Alright, so, last time on Mass Effect 2, the Collectors took everybody, and I'm real upset by it. So, we're going to immediately do what we can do to get everybody back. Are you guys ready? Because I am. Alright, yep, uh, Josh is in chat. Everybody, make sure you say thanks, Josh, for doing... Uh, work that no one wants to do because you often don't get a lot of praise and you get a lot of anger so thank you josh and uh he will use emo only and all that stuff whenever he needs to uh so appreciate it i need to check my journal stop the collectors the collectors have attacked the normandy and have taken all of the crew except joker the reaper iff is fully operational and the assault on the Collector base can begin as soon as the assault team is ready. Use Omega-4 Relay to begin the final assault upon the Collector base. Let's do it. Omega-4 Relay. Surrounded by, a hazard, uh, by hazard beacons and automated warnings over the last thousand years, many ships have attempted to pass through it, but none have returned. The only ones that pass freely back and forth through the relay are the mysterious collectors. There are many theories why ships never return from Omega-4. Some say there is a black hole at the far end. Others, mostly the impoverished underclass of Omega, believe there is some form of earthly paradise. Most, however, however, simply think that the collectors capture or destroy those passing through the relay. Please confirm destination, Shepard. The Reaper IFF is online, but there is a chance that the Normandy may not survive the Omega-4 relay. Once we are en route, we are committed. Confirm! We have to rescue our crew. I'm done waiting. Wait, I need everything ready. <laughs> The collectors took my people. Time to go get them back. You got it, Commander. Plotting a course for the Omega-4 relay. ETA about two hours. I'll let you know when we arrive. Okay, two hours. Now I have to wait. It's gonna be most of the stream. This is a shame. So, I've taken some antibiotics as well as some herbal substances. <laughs> oh, we're pausing. This is exciting. I'm going to make the game audio go up a little tiny bit. So one second.
Okay. Is Tali ready for this? Is Shepard ready for this? Am I ready for this? Are you ready for this? Bolster my immune system. I was going to bring music, but I didn't know what you'd like. And I'm babbling like an idiot. <laughs> it's terrible. No, it changed my mind? How could you do that? It's okay. Come here. I just don't want to. I want this to work. I found it over. I've minimized the risks, but I'm still nervous. Man, I want it to work out for these kids. People who who just see the helmet can't see my expression, so I have to make it clear what I'm what I'm feeling. I want to see her face! I don't need to. Because she's a great person regardless of what she looks like. And we got two hours, too. Ooh, the elusive man. Shepard, I wish I had more information for you. I don't like you heading through that relay blind. But we don't have much choice. The team is strong. I'm not going alone. I've got some of the best working with me. If we stick together, we'll make it. I knew we brought you back for a reason. I've never seen a better leader. Despite the danger, it's a great opportunity. The first human to take a ship through and survive. This is an affiliate ship. We should be going. Join us! Ooh. No, field trip. I'm going to destroy the Collectors to stop their attacks on humanity. Understood. It's still impressive. I just wanted you to know I appreciate the risk you're taking. Regardless yeah. of your opinion of Cerberus, uh -huh. of me, you are a valuable asset to all of humanity. Almost give me a shit ton of money when I'm done, huh? How about that? Like a lot. I know you got a lot. Look at your place. Okay. Oh, it's an angry looking relay. Approaching a Mega 4 relay. Everyone stand by. Let's make it happen. Reaper IFF activated. Signal acknowledged. Commander, drive core just lit up like a Christmas tree. Drive core electrical charge at critical levels. Rerouting. Suicide mission. Break Trophy. Oh shit. oh shit, Joker! I trust you. Good job, buddy. You deserve to have been a playable character. Well, these must be all the ships that tried to make it through Whoa. the Omega 4 relay. Some look ancient. I have detected an energy signature near the edge of the accretion disk. Huh. Hole over there. It looks Has like to be the collector base. Take us in for a closer look. Nice and easy. But not close enough to the event horizon. Check. Okay. Careful, Jeff. We have company. Jeff. He calls him Jeff. They love each other, I think. Taking evasive maneuvers. Come on, Joker. Yeah, they're just pissing me off. Ha! Take these bastards out. As long as the new plating holds. Yeah, I got upgrades. You want another round? Did I get all the upgrades? I hope I got all the upgrades. Everybody, why aren't you wearing your seatbelts? Alert. Hall 
Engineering, engineering will do. In the cargo hold. I'll take a team and deal with the Tommy! You get the rest of them off our tail. Aye, aye, Commander. Um. Okay. I gotta take a team. If I take Tally, then she'll be okay. Because they're in engineering. <laughs> um. I'm gonna take Tally and Grunt. Grunt's gonna do some work. I think that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> Squad points at one, one, five, eh? Mm -hmm. Um, fortification. A brief but massive boost to your armor sounds great. And we have improved or heavy. The armor is more resilient and reacts better to multiple hits, increasing the duration. Uh, absorbs even more damage, so longer or even more. Hmm, I feel like longer might be for the better. We're gonna do that. Oh my god! I should use this. Oculus! Oh no, it's the Oculus Rift! Facebook is here! Synthetic targets. Okay. Our kinetic barriers are not designed to survive impact debris that size, Jeff. Well, I guess it's a good thing we upgraded. We're going in. We did upgrade. We're just gonna tank it. I did all of that mining on worlds. Damn, what would happen if I didn't have it? This music is amazing. Tally! Oh no, that's not Tally. Never mind. Assume that you're good. I'm surprised you're off that couch though. No significant damage. Take the helm, Edie, and keep it slow. See if we can avoid any more attention. I have detected an enemy heading for the cargo hold. That thing again. This one's up to Shepard. Shield in my face. We're about to clear the debris field. There it is, the collector base. And the eye of Sauron. See if you can find a place to land without drawing attention. Well, too late. Looks like they're sending out an old friend to greet us. That one that attacked us, huh? <laughs> All right, Joker. Redemption. They are so well calibrated. How do you like that, you sons of bitches? Get in close and finish them off. Everybody hold on, gonna be a wild ride. Seatbelts. Give him hell, girl. 
Yeah. Oh fuck you. Look out. What? Oh shit. I think we're good. Oh, oh shit. Mass effect field generators are offline. Edie, give me something. Generators unresponsive. All the for impact. Uh, uh. Did I have enough upgrades? Joker, you okay? I think I broke a rib. Ah. Or all of them. Oh, Multiple man. core systems overloaded during the crash. Restoring operation will take time. Okay. We all knew this was likely a one-way trip. Our primary objective is to destroy the station and stop the collectors at any cost. Well, then we're off to a good start. And get the crew. What's next? We're gonna get the crew. Is the ship safe? How long here? until the collectors find this landing zone? I do not detect an internal security network. It is possible the collectors do not expect anyone to reach the base. Well, if we're lucky, their external sensors were hit like we were. They might not know we're alive. Okay. Ooh. I wish I could just bring like my whole crew with me into here. Okay, we got the whole crew here though. This is cool. This isn't how we planned this mission, but this is where we're at. We can't worry about whether the Normandy can get us home. We came to stop the collectors, and that means coming up with a plan to take out this station. Yeah. Edie, bring up your scans. You should be able to overload their critical systems if you get to the main control center here. That means going through the heart of the station, right past this massive energy signature. That's the central chamber. If our crew or any of the colonists are still alive, the collectors are probably holding them in there. Okay. Looks like there are two main routes. Might be a good idea to split up to keep the collectors off balance, then regroup in the central chamber. No good. Both routes are blocked. See these doors? The only Don't way like past to is up. to get someone to open them from the other side. <sighs> Let's look for alternates. We create a distraction. Let's blow the doors wide open. It's not a fortress. There's got to be something. Here. Maybe we can send someone in through this ventilation shaft. Practically a suicide mission. I volunteer. Shaft. I appreciate the thought, Jacob, but you couldn't shut down the security systems in time. We need to send a tech expert. It's your call, Commander. Tech we'll expert. Send into the shaft. Ah. Uh, okay. Oh man. I don't like splitting everybody up. I'm in a relationship. I want to be in. Last time I split up, I got out of a relationship. It's time I'm staying in, baby! Okay, okay. Tech expert. I feel like we got Tali. She has some tech stuff. But I feel like Legion is our literal tech expert. He can speak to machines. Super quick. I think Legion is the one to go. Not Jacob, not Garrus. Grunt's not even on this list. <laughs> okay, Legion, we're gonna go Legion. Tech expert to unlock the door. Legion, you can act through anything. I'm sending you into the shaft. Okay. Acknowledged. The rest of us will break into two teams and fight down each Two teams. That should draw the collector's attention away from what you're doing. I'll lead the second fire team, Shepard. We'll meet up with you on the other side of the doors. Not so fast, cheerleader. Nobody wants to take orders from you. This isn't a popularity contest. Lives are at stake. Shepard, you need someone who can command loyalty through experience. Oh, man. I have an immediate gut reaction. I 
think. And I do realize that you can go all the way down, by the way. My immediate gut reaction is my boy, my homie, Garrus. If there is going to be someone on a second squad, I trust him to do what needs to be done. Garrus will command respect through experience, redemption, fucking sweet face scars. But is there another option? Who else? Second squad. Choose the leader for the alternate squad. I don't want, But what if something happens to the other squad? What happens is, what if something happens to the tech expert? Legion is great. Go with my gut. I go with who I trust. I go with who I love. Garrus, you're in charge of the second team. Okay, he didn't say At least anything. He knows what he's doing. <laughs> I hope that's the right decision. No speeches, let's move out. No, there needs to be something said. I don't know what we're going to find in there, but I won't lie to you. It's not going to be easy. We've lost good people. We may lose more. Lives depend on us. This isn't just about revenge. This is about protecting the crew. You guys in this room, and the whole fucking galaxy! We don't know how many the collectors have stolen. Thousands, hundreds of thousands. It's not important. What matters is this. Not one more. That's what we can do, here, today. It ends with us. They want to know what we're made of? I say we show them, on our terms. Let's bring our people home. Let's fucking go! Fucking go. I'm so fucking ready. Ugh. Squad selection, fire team specialist. Okay. Um, all right. I'm so hyped. Okay. Squad selection. So he's specialist. I can't pick him. If I can pick anybody else to go on my team. Let's go with Miranda. This one probably, it probably doesn't matter as much as the big ones I just did, I don't think. take Miranda and let's take Morden for now kind of like no cancel Miranda and Thane I think that might be the squad I don't know maybe not and Miranda. Yes. <sighs> they just had said We 
in position. Exterior temperature slightly elevated. No obstructions detected. Second team, are you in position? In position. Meet you on the other side of those doors. They've seen it. Come out, you fucks! Gear is here. We're taking heavy fire, but we're moving forward. This music is killing. Disable valve. Oh. There, over by the ventilation shaft. That valve should open the gate. That's Legion, okay. Legion, you got it, buddy. Intervention is necessary. You must locate another Face your annihilation. Specialist in danger. This hurts you. Three of eight. All right, Legion, we got this, buddy. Fucking wish! This hurts you. This is what you face. Feel. That's not good. That's not good. More fire. We got it, buddy. We got it. We're good.
I'm so proud of everybody. Shepard, you need to see this. What? 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 Is someone shot? Or is it collections? like one of the missing colonists. Kind of like an amber. He's alive. There's more. Over here. And then our crew. Is our crew in there? God. She's still alive. Get her out? Or is it bad to get her out? so mean <laughs> no one gets left behind thank god you got here in time a few more seconds and i don't even want to think about it Ugh. the colonists were what about fitz and simmons those swarms of little robots they melted their bodies into gray liquid and pumped it through these tubes why are they doing this what are they doing with our genetic material? I don't know. I'm just glad you got here before it happened to us. So are we. But we still have a job to do. We've done well so far. Let's hope we can finish the job. Joker, can you get a fix on our position? Roger that, Commander. All those tubes lead into the main control room right above you. The route is blocked by a security door, but there's another chamber that runs parallel to the one you're in. I cannot recommend that. Thermal emissions suggest the chamber is overrun with seeker swarms. Morton's countermeasure cannot protect you against so many at once. Do they have a weakness? What about biotics? Could we create a biotic field to keep them from getting near us? Yes, I think it may be possible. I wouldn't be able to protect everyone, but we might be able to get a small team through if they stayed close. I could do it too. In theory, any biotic could handle it. Shepard, who do you want to maintain the field? So, I feel like my two powerhouses in terms of the biotic is Samara or Jack. Jack, I mean, is, like, really fucking good. Samara is extremely disciplined. But I feel like this is about sheer... Like they said, like, any biotic could do it, but it's gonna take a lot of power. So Jack seems to be the one. I 
appreciate all you guys holding the line. <laughs> I'm gonna go with my gut. I always felt like Jack was known for power and when it comes to bionic abilities. So I'm gonna go with Jack. Thane, Miranda, Jacob. Samara, Jack. Jack! Jack and I will take a small team through the Seeker Swarms. The rest of you provide a diversion by going through the main passage. We'll open the security doors from the other side and meet you there. Who should lead the diversion team? Oh, fucking Jesus. Choose a leader for the alternate squad. I mean, Garrus did well. Should I not have Garrus, though? Diversion. Who's good with diversion? Well, first of all, it needs to be a leader. I feel like in terms of leadership... That leaves us with... Miranda Jacob might do good in, when it comes to leading. And Garrus. No, 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 no. Samara's not really a leader. She's more of like a lone wolf. Thane, I don't think would... He's not... He's also... Those, yeah. To me, it's Garrus... For his police background, Miranda and Jacob, military, spy work. I think I'm going to go Jacob. Seasoned combat professional and veteran of the Alliance military. I think he's going to, I think Jacob would do well. I don't know. I don't know how important these choices are. I don't know what they mean. Jacob's Alliance military. Miranda is like a covert spy. She's a brilliant tactician. He's just a combat professional. Go Miranda. Miranda's gonna lead this team. I'll keep the defenders busy while you slip in the back. What about me and the rest of the crew, Shepard? We're in no shape to fight. Commander, we have enough systems back online to do a pickup, but we need to land back from your position. We can't afford to go back, Shepard. Not now. No, we... They can't fight... We'll have someone escort you. You'll never make it without help. I'll send someone with you. Okay. Who goes back with them? I mean, I assume that this... Send the good doctor back with the doctor. Two doctors are better than none. Morden? Joker, need location of landing zone. We'll meet you there. We've all got our assignments. Let's move up. <sighs> okay. Who goes into the squad? Jack is our specialist. Let's bring Tali and Samara. Because I feel bad I didn't give Samara the specialist job, but. She can work with me. Yes. I like the squad. Moving out. 
All right. All right, Jack. Cool. Swarms are interfering with radio contact. You ready for this? I'm assuming I can go out. Yep, I can. <laughs> All right, move out, Jack. Let's go, Commander. Incoming. We've been spotted. Acquiring target. I can't fight you back like this. Tell me when you're ready to move. Oh. fire. Doing good with the sniper right now. If I must tear you apart, Shepard, I will. I was gonna say it's cool to have four people on, a, on like a crew like this. I like it. 
feel like we're just going too slow. Is the other squad doing okay? Could be a real firefight. I'll hold this position until you're ready to move out. Sounds like they're doing okay over there. Husk. Where's the husk? There. Trying to hold on. You got this, Jack. You got this. Give Jack like a Snickers or something. Need to get there soon. Come on, Jack. Huh? Jack's jogging downhill. Entrance. Jack. They're pushing. Keep it up. Hurry, Shepard. Fuck yeah, Jack. I'm so proud of her. She did a good job. I don't think she overexerted herself. Okay. What's your position? We're at the door. They've got us pinned down. They're pinned. Oh, the docks got back Just okay. Get this door open. Come on. Seal the door. Is everybody here? <gasps> no. I'm ready for action, Commander. You okay? She was holding her. You know? Joker, are you at the rendezvous point? I'm here, Commander. Chuck was in the rest of the crew. Okay. Excellent. Now let's make it count. Edie, what's our next step? There should be some nearby platforms that will take you to the main control console. From there, you can overload the system and destroy the base. Commander, you got a problem. Hostiles massing just outside the door. Won't be long till I bust through. Someone has to hold this door. We better hurry. Someone has to hold this door. A oh, rear man. guard could defend this position and keep the collectors from overwhelming us. Pick a team to go with you, Shepard. Everyone else can bunker down here and cover your back. Man, you guys are really holding that line. Okay. So everybody else will hold the hold the line, hold the line. <laughs> we'll hold the door. I feel like that means we need our heavy hitters like Grunt, Zaid, 
they stay. So I need I need a squad to go up. This is like to the final thing, right? I hope people don't get too upset with me. Just keeps I keep taking Tolly with me, but I love having Tolly with me. Like I'm gonna take, take Tolly. I mean, like, Kasumi and Thane, Thane may be more so than Kasumi. She seems like she's not necessarily a barricade in and, and hold off and take, you know. I don't know. Maybe Garrus. Garrus is really good at one position and defending it by being a sniper, so maybe not Garrus. Kind of between... Thane? Maybe Thane. No. Jack. No. Yes. I think Jack just proved herself right here, but she, that's a moment. She's had her moment to shine. I think Thane. I think I'm going to go Thane and Tally. Two great. One second. I want to make sure I have the right. He doesn't have his sunglasses on, does he? I definitely don't want those fucking sunglasses, I'll tell you that. And he's going to be wearing white because he's coming to our wedding. I don't know why that makes sense. <laughs> Thane. I think this is my crew. I'm ready, Commander. As am I. Anything to say before we do this? The galaxy is depending on us. The Collectors, the Reapers, they aren't a threat to us. They're a threat to everything. Everyone. Those are the lives we're fighting for. That's the scale. Man, he is really good at that. It's been a long journey, and no one's coming out without scars. But it all comes down to this moment. We win or lose it all in the next few minutes. Uh... Make me proud. Make yourselves proud. We'll do our best. Good luck, Shepard. Alright, you two. I know that I could choose anyone, but I'm proud you two are with me. What are we doing?
see him getting so close. Damn, I was hoping for a no death one on this one. Have any ammo anywhere? Uh, here. Cool. Where else? I'm missing it. All right, I think we're okay. I always, I, I suck at spotting ammo on the ground. This is it. All the tubes lead to this spot. Edie, what can you tell us? What are they doing? So it's melting down people and it sending them reading. to this spot. It must be massive. Shepard, if my calculations are correct, the superstructure is a Reaper. Not just any Reaper. A what? Human Reaper. Precisely. Human Reaper? If that's why they're... a human G 
Jesus. That's why they're collecting humans. What did the collectors gain by turning humans into this Reaper shell? They may be facilitating the Reaper equivalent of reproduction. Or it may serve another purpose. I do not have the data to speculate further. However, it is clear that the collectors are merely pawns. The technology and ability needed to create this Reaper is not their own. It is likely that different species construct each Reaper. In this case, the collectors provide the labor. Man. Collectors are just Protheans. Why would they help the Reapers? The Reapers subdued the Protheans long ago. Probability suggests they attempted to create a Prothean Reaper and failed. Over time, they adapted the Protheans to suit their needs, changed them, turned them into workers, tools for the Reapers. They're building it to look like a human. Why? It appears that a Reaper's shape is based upon the species used to create it. It appears that a reaper shape is based on the species used to create it. So they gather, collect the species, and then to create a reaper, it, it becomes what it's made out of. You are what you eat, that kind of thing, okay. Reapers are machines. Why do they need humans at all? Incorrect. Reapers are sapient constructs, a hybrid of organic and inorganic material. Hybrid. The exact construction methods are unclear, but it seems probable that the reapers absorb the essence of a species utilizing it in the reproduction process. It's perverse. How many more humans do you think they try to take? Millions. Perhaps more. Impossible to know for certain. This Reaper appears to be in a very early stage of development. An embryo in human terms. So it's not alive yet? We can still stop it from being created? get option it should be like all right let's abort this thing then how many more humans do you think they try to take oh i already got this millions this reaper appears to be in a very early stage of development we can't let it survive how do we stop this let's take it down we can't let this thing finish definitely this thing is an abomination eating how do we destroy it the large tubes injecting the fluid are a weak structural link Give us a minute, Edie. We've got to take care of some old friends first. Enemy incoming. Report. Oh no, did it fall on them? I'm tagging them as they come. But feel free to call for an exit any time. Head to the Normandy. Joker, prep the engines. I'm about to overload this place and blow it sky high. Roger that, Commander. Okay, blow it up. Uh, Commander, I've got an incoming signal from the elusive man. He's passing it through. 
Okay. Shepard, you've done the impossible. Well, I didn't do it alone. I was part of a team. <sighs> Some of them gave their lives for this mission. I know. Their sacrifice will not be forgotten. You did what you had to do, and you acquired the collector base. I'm looking at the schematics Edie uploaded. A timed radiation pulse would kill the remaining collectors, but leave the machinery and technology intact. This is our chance, Shepard. They were building a Reaper. That knowledge, that framework could save us. I don't know. They liquefied people, turned them into something horrible. Yeah. We have to destroy the base. Don't be short-sighted. Our best chance against the Reapers is to turn their own resources against them. They were working directly with the Collectors. Who knows what information is buried there? This base is a gift. We can't just destroy it. You're completely ruthless. The next thing I know, you'll be wanting to grow your own Reaper. My goal is to save humanity from the Reapers, at any cost. I've never hidden that from you. True. Imagine how many lives could be saved if we keep this base intact and use its knowledge to thwart the Reapers. Imagine the lives that will be lost if we don't. I don't know. This... No matter what kind of technology we might find, it's not worth it. Shepard, you died fighting for what you believed. I brought you back so you could keep fighting. Some would say what we did to you was going too far, but look what you've accomplished. I didn't discard you because I knew your value. Don't be so quick to discard this facility. Think of the potential. You brought me back. You thought I had value. But my gut says no, we don't need it. This is nothing. There's nothing to be gained here. We'll fight and win without it. I won't let fear compromise who I am. Yeah. Shepard. Think about what's at stake, about everything Cerberus has done for you. You. Yeah, Tali, hang up! Let's move. We've got ten minutes before the reactor overloads and blows this whole station apart. Ten minutes. Is everyone down the other squad okay? Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck, Larva! Oh, shit, it's fast! Over here. You guys can take care of those, right?
Ooh, okay, I think we're doing good. I'm always good for the eyes. Zelda rules, baby. Don't you let go! Tally, are we okay? We only, okay, we got like 10 minutes still, right? This thing's gonna blow up. His fate will be the same as ours. Yeah, come on. You okay? Where's Tali? up your ship, bitch. You Joker. Yeah, Joker, shoot. Oh, shit. primary ignition. Oh, what's happening, Harbinger? Oh, will you? We will find another way. That's good for you. Control. <laughs> Blow up with your bitch ass. I think that's loss number two, Reapers. Man, the elusive man is not gonna be happy. <laughs> I don't, he, he owes me. He owes me money, you know what I'm saying? accomplished. Shepard, you're making a habit of costing me more than time and money. That was fucking crazy. We did it. Is that the mission? I was that was so stressful. I think we're done. Uh, with that, but choosing people, just trying to like remember like what are their strengths, what are their stories, all that. Let's uh, let's get through the uh, elusive man. I have so many thoughts and feelings and emotions right now. Too many lives were lost at that base. I'm not sorry it's gone. The first of many lives. The technology from that base could have secured human dominance in the galaxy against the Reapers and beyond. It's not how we human fight, man. Or just Cerberus. Strength I for Cerberus is strength for every human. There, Cerberus is humanity. 
I should have known you'd choke on the hard decisions. Too idealistic from the start. You're on my team now, bitch. <laughs> Sorry, I keep doing that. I'm not looking for your approval. Harbinger is coming, and he won't be alone. Humanity needs a leader who's looking out for them. From now on, I'm doing things my way, whether you agree or not. Don't turn your back on me, Shepard. I made you. I brought you back from the dead. Dude, shut your mouth. You brought me because you know you needed me. Alright? No one needed you. Joker, lose this channel. Tali, hang up. Hope we didn't make a big, big enemy. left behind man we went through some shit I'm so glad I upgraded the ship I haven't seen Fitz and Simmons are they okay I don't know if I've seen them Look at my crew, they're so pretty. So beautiful. Like, none of them are for the elusive man. They're all loyal, baby! Reapers coming through the galaxy. Oh, fuck. That's it. That's it. That's it. Of course, that's it. That's great. I think I feel okay. <laughs> I was so worried the whole time. Oh, no, the fish. Oh, no, the fish. I should do it at the beginning of the... Oh, no, I forgot about the fish. I hope they're okay. give a hand for all these very talented people that made such a great middle chapter for this trilogy. Right? Good job everyone to have a part in this. Nice being able to, to read now. Eric, you had no badly how this was going to go. Yeah, I still have a rival. Uh, I still have a rival to do, so I will do that. Man, this music is fantastic. The whole stream's music has been fantastic. It was like the strongest part of a, of a completely across the board strong presentation. Interesting. So you could have lost a lot of people. Is it just like... It, I imagine that making sure you have all the upgrades is the one. Because when we were flying in to the collector station, that was the one they kept referencing, was all of the upgrades. So I'm glad I got all the upgrades. Um, what we had? We had our tech specialists. We had the biotic specialists. Two team leaders? Is that everything in terms of choices? You can lose every single person except Joker and Shepard. What? Oh, you can take Miranda. So that's why it's called Suicide Mission. Man, it's going real fast. I'm trying. Shepard can die too? What? Does that just mean you can't... Does that... Oh, that just means you probably just can't play Mass Effect 3. <laughs> right? Loyalty of the characters was important. Okay. I got loyalty for everybody. That was like the, one of the first things I wanted to do for everyone, so... You can't import the game from Mass Effect 3. That makes sense. Okay. You have to make a whole new character. There's a full-page flow, uh, flow chart for this mission. 
It's complicated. Oh, okay. So I'm assuming I just make good choices? I mean, I feel like Legion for tech was the obvious choice. I feel like between Samara and Jack for uh, Biotic is obvious choice. Loyalty, specialisms, and picking the right escort. Okay. Perfect run? Okay. For the tech expert, you could also use Tali or Kasumi. Okay. Yeah, I, I kind of thought about uh, Tali for a second. If you didn't get all the ship upgrades, a random member would just die? For each one you missed? If you don't leave Garrus, Grunt, Zahid to hold the line at the end, you lose someone? What? I almost brought Garrus with me! A leader can be Garrus, Miranda, or Jacob. Okay, that one makes sense. Alright. Unloyal people can get loyal people killed. Man, I don't want to see that, but I kind of want to see... What happens when all that happens? I mean, that just that has to change so much in the third game. If Miranda goes to the end, she res uh, resigns in the elusive man's face. That would have been really cool to see. I wanted to do that. Everyone dies ending on YouTube. I might have to check that out tonight. Hmm. Uh, I'm not set up right now to react to the bad ending. Uh, maybe I'll try to do that for next time. <laughs> uh, you could have taken Garrus to the final battle. Each squad mate is given a value of defense. You need to have a certain score. Okay, so everyone is assigned some type of value, and you need to meet like a certain threshold. Huh. Oh, you lost Jack's loyalty when she argued with Miranda. That's interesting. Morden has the most percentage to die. Well, it's good that I thought the doctor should take the doctor then. Huh. Yeah. Oh, holy shit, man. That was great. These last... This whole... The whole game was good. And I'm not even done. I still have a rival... I still have other missions. I don't know if the other missions are that important to have on stream. I think I can just finish those. I mean, it's only 7.30. So we'll probably play the DLC. Thank you guys for having me, for, for re-experiencing this game with me. I'm glad that so many people, and I can see why, they have, their loyalty missions have been done long ago, and I have just completed my loyalty mission to Mass Effect. Uh, it's really, really great. It's one of my... And I was, th I was telling, talking to the guys the other day about this. We were talking about like favorite games of all time. And at the very least, because I mean, I love Ocarina of Time, and I love uh, I love a bunch of different type of games that I've played on my own. But at the very least, on stream, I really think that between God of War and Mass Effect, I don't know which one is my favorite. Dragon Age. I know people have liked Dragon Age. Uh, yeah, uh, Drew Karpishian is one of the writers of Mass Effect. Uh, he's one of the writers of KOTOR in general, not just Bane, um, the Bar Darth Bane series. So, yeah, I'm a big fan of Drew. If you have delayed... Yeah, I figured that they were like, you need to go right now. Especially last week when, when I was like, well, maybe I'll burn 20 minutes and, uh... You know, just do something else before we go, and everybody's like, no, don't! I'm like, okay, maybe that must be a factor. You need to go immediately uh, for everything. And I uh, I want to thank everybody for holding the line and uh, keeping spoilers out of chat, though, I mean, I, 
the few times I looked over, I only saw Hold the Line, so I have to assume that everybody was extremely well behaved and Josh hadn't didn't have to do uh, any work. <laughs> Uh, do we want to exit the credits? Kind of, because, I mean, in respect to everybody here, but I want to get into Arrival, because we got uh, an hour and a half. And hopefully that's enough time for Arrival. Did I miss some hydration? Okay, you have stopped the Collectors from creating a human Reaper. You now have two choices. Continue this game, complete unfinished missions, develop relationships, Play downloaded content and explore the galaxy for anything you missed. Or import Shepard. Start a new game with this character as your current uh, at your current level with your current weapons, as well as bonus starting credits and resources. That's kind of cool, but I imagine it is continue. Right? I hit continue and not main menu. So that's New Game Plus. Oh, fishies, you're okay! Uh, well, let's check our messages. Wait, up no, first. Space Hamster. You were vital too, buddy. Wait. Yeah. Let's check our messages. No new messages, huh? Save the galaxy. No one can fucking send an email. Oh, Leroy, thank you so much for the gifted subs. Alright, we gotta go and just have a good old talk <laughs> with everybody. Let's talk to Kelly, because Kelly survived. They must have just came in, Kelly. You came for us. I knew you would. Thank you. A thousand times, thank you. Are you okay? How are you doing, Kelly? I'm holding up. Just can't get the memories out of my head. Trapped. Suffocating. It's oozing into every pore. Faint sobs oh, echoing the confined space. Pain. But I, I can't dwell on it. I'm okay now. I'm alive. Back to the old Kelly. Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. Take care. To Paragon. I don't have any new messages. I thought she said I had un I had messages. How is everybody? You guys okay? You cool? You cool? I'm assuming you're cool. Joker! Did we tear the collectors a new one? Yeah. Commander really pulled through. Joker! Is Shepard glad that Collector Reaper crap is over? It is over, right? It's never over. It's never over. The good old days. How are things in the cockpit? I assume everything is going well up here. You know, this is really nice. Edie took up the slack in every department. I could get used to this kind of help. It is not my intention to assume all of your responsibilities, Jeff. No, 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 I'm good. Just keep me updated. Quietly. Edie isn't a crutch. I want your eyes on everything. Eyes are easy. Yeah, I don't I believe eyes. I lost anybody. I, I still... I haven't seen my, my engineer crew on the tough to bottom of the ship. I want to go down and check there. The hang of it. Joker. All right, all right. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Anything from you? Hype train, guys. Thank you, uh, Lord Oxinator. Thank you very much for the Amazon Prime subscription. Yes, Shepard. Nothing new from Edie. It doesn't seem like. I want to know more about you. Do you have a specific inquiry? All right. That's all for now. Logging you out, Shepard. Let's go talk to Jacob. 
I almost made Jacob one of the uh, squad leaders. Didn't expect you to light up that base, Shepard. Hell of a way to tell the boss you're quitting. I wish I could have seen his face. Leroy, thank over, you. Though. Bad Hi, Cortez. Fessilizing. And now Cerberus wants your tail. Never boring, huh? I don't know what kind of time we have, but we better dust off and stay ready. You sure as hell not to make enemies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is there not much? It's just they have a response at the end of the game, but I think I just want to talk and ser service after Alliance isn't really forwarding anything new. Cool. We'll talk later. Let's go uh, talk to everybody. Let's go talk to the doctor. He made it back. He brought everybody back. I'm happy. I don't believe he sterilized any of them. Collectors destroyed. Base in ruins. Extremely impressive. Elusive man will be displeased. Fortunately, not human myself. Not my problem. <laughs> Let's talk about him. Have you got a minute to talk? Not at the moment. Think I've unlocked collector interest in humans. Wait, no. Only one heart. Krogan had two. <laughs> Scratch that. Anything else? I'll let you work. We'll be here. All right. I believe that's everybody to talk to up here. So let's go down a level. We're going to talk to the good doctor. I'm still a little shaken from my abduction by the collectors. It was a lot to endure. You and Jeff came so quickly. Never had truer friends. Thank you, Commander. You're welcome. Legion! An interesting choice, Shepard Commander. Your species was offered everything Geth aspired to true unity, understanding, transcendence. You rejected it. You even refused the possibility of using the old machine's gifts to achieve it on your species' own terms. Yep. You are more like this than we thought. Hmm. I'd like to find out more about you. Specify. I've never encountered a Geth that had more than animal intelligence. We are a unique hardware platform. Most mobile platforms can run up to 100 programs. This platform can run over a thousand at once. Guys, thank you so much for all the subscriptions. Kingsley? Jake? Stiv? Stig, I mean. And thank you guys so much. The hype train is real. So I'm talking to a thousand programs, but not a thousand personalities? Each individual is equivalent to one of your virtual intelligence programs. Together, we form a single gestalt intellect, what you refer to as Legion. As individual programs, we are no more than your software. Only when we share data do we become more. So Geth form a network. So Geth have to be networked to get enough computing power for intelligence. Yes. The creators wrote Geth programs for specific tasks. Construction, protection, domestic servitude. However, they allowed self-optimization. Early software builds discovered that multiple hardware platforms sharing resources were often more effective. As peer networks expanded, our cognition improved. Eventually, we woke up. You're more sophisticated than the average Geth. Yes, we are a network within our own hardware, capable of operating alone. Mm -hmm. We are still connected to the greater network for data sharing. Cool. How many other Geth are like you? None. This platform God. is built to operate within organic space. This task was not suited for a network. Geth installed in mobile platforms always operate in networks. However, most Geth remain within server hubs. So you're in contact with the rest of the Geth right now? Only when we require access to data not stored. Leroy, 10,000 bits, thank if you. If you want to convey a message to the Geth, we serve as a terminal. 
<laughs> you guys are going ham over there. Trying to learn about Geth. <laughs> 97% with two minutes left, 240. Thank you guys very much. Ah, 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 you guys are now. What do you share? I feel like I missed one here. And there it is. There's the hype train. Nepco subscribes. Thank you very much. Punk Floyd. I'm, I'm sorry, it's going too fast. I'm missing him. <laughs> I'm trying to learn lore. <laughs> yeah, uh, there are more like you, I think, Pick is another you? response. None. This platform was built to operate within organic space. This task was not suited. Geth installed in mobile platforms. Always uh, Varix, thank networks. you. However, most Geth remain within server hubs. SG, thank you. Uh, Isiav, I'm sorry if I can't pronounce your names, thank you. <laughs> Very much. Um, tell me about Geth hubs. The hubs on Vermeer improve the performance of Geth near them. How do they work? They are akin to organic cities. A hub can run millions of Geth in communion. If you destroy them, it is likely the number of heretics you killed was much higher than you imagined. Interesting. Man, you guys are going crazy. Uh, we got 300 bits. Just acquired games. Gifting a sub. Come my, my with the prime. Uh, citizen. Got hydrate. I got the hydrate. Merry Christmas. <laughs> We're giving you the lore of the hype train. <laughs> Red Buddha, you think that the Mass Effect 3 is the best? I'm excited for that. I can't wait to play. Uh, I don't know quite yet, just because of holiday time and, and all that, if I'll be able to stream next week. Um, I'll let you guys know. But it's very well might be that in the new year, Mass Effect 3 starts first week of the new year, so that might be more poetic, too. Um, but we'll see. I'll let you, everybody know. Oh, my God. Peculiar Maz gifting 10 subs. Thank you so much. Xana Jesse. Thank you guys so much. I, I have to continue. I'll never get to a rival. What kind of data do you share? Program updates, logs of thought process, sensor recordings. Legion is attempting to access the ship's FTL comm system. Shall I allow it through my firewalls? Yes. Go ahead, Edie. Our oldest log is timestamped from creator year 2463, third day of fall dash, waxing moon, roughly 327 years 327 ago. years. The oldest audiovisual record dates from 15 years after that. Can you replay something for me? Recording timestamp from creator year 2485, 18th day of Loon Shao, New Moon. Mistress Hala Dama, unit has an inquiry. What is it, 431? Do these units have a soul? taught you that word. We learned it ourselves. It appears 216 times in the scroll of ancestors. Only quarians have souls. You're a mechanism. Recording ends. Was that the first time a Geth out <coughs> had a soul? No. It was the first time a creator became frightened when we asked. Ooh, that's a cool response. Are our network secure, Edie? Legion had to go through you. I have never interfaced with another machine intelligence. Legion is a thousand voices talking at once. What it contacted was beyond my comprehension. A mind the size of a galactic arm. How do you maintain stability without other minds to interact with? I manage. Some minutes are more difficult than others. Hmm. It's interesting them two talking together. 
That's interesting, but I must get back to my duties. We will remain here. Geth technology. Okay. All right. Let's go and talk with... I can't believe you took down the Collectors. I'm proud to serve under you, Commander. Hawthorne is still in the infirmary, though I think his pride is more broken than his bones. Hawthorne! He tried so hard to help Joker. Level two completed. Good job, guys. You really are a hero. No sooner had the Collectors damned us than you were pulling our sorry asses right back out of hell. Your aces in my book, Shepard. Thank you. All right, Gardner. I'm glad Gardner made it. Garrus, squad leader. For Saren, now the Collectors. Remind me never to get on your bad side, Shepard. I almost feel sorry for the Reapers. <laughs> Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Hey man, you do your calibrations. You did Dr. great. Lord, they were so I'll calibrated need for whenever we needed those weapons. Let's talk to Miranda. And it seems like she's not too upset that we have broken it off with the elusive man. We had to do it, Shepard. Taking down the collector base was the right decision. The elusive man might not agree, but we had no choice. Nice. I'll let you work. Of course, Commander. All right, all right, all right. Let's go talk to... Thane. You had to make a difficult choice, Shepard, for what it's worth. I believe you made the correct one. Yeah. I should go. I shall return to my meditation. I like everybody praising me, and then I immediately leave. Praise me! Hey, got a minute? I do, to, for praise. So, you and Tally finally got together, eh? Don't worry, I won't Praise. Fall. She took her mask off with you. That took a lot of trust on her part. Joker and Edie are like an old married couple. I keep expecting to walk in on them bickering about the temperature in the cockpit. Edie has a wicked sense of humor. Or I should say, a really funny lack of one. Sometimes she seems like a person. But when it comes down to it, I can't get past her being a computer. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. All right. She did have a lot to talk about. I... she did. What about you two in here? I never want to go through anything like that again. But we did it. I can't wait to get back to Earth and see my family. I wanted to tell you, I believe you did the right thing. I'm glad to everybody the, the elusive man likes it. he has the wisdom to utilize it. But he does not. But he does not. Upgrades. Do you have any suggestions about using some of the resources we've gathered? I have done what I can to increase our exploration capabilities. Anything beyond that is up to you. I should go. Of course. Um, yeah, I've played Nice World Republic back in the day, like, ten times. Um, and I'm really looking forward to the remake, honestly. But uh, Dragon Age will be interesting. We'll see. I still have a whole other Mass Effect game to get through. What do you got to say, bud? This mission takes me back. Joker handled himself well. Should have come back here and got a real weapon. Still, did real well for a kid with glass bones. Pretty sure I'd be laid up in bed if I were him. Ever been to a Batarian prison? They don't trust you enough to sell you into slavery. That's why they sent you. In there, you got two choices. Bash your head open on the wall. In Andromeda, or kill yeah. everyone between you and the exit. I should let you go. Talk more later, Shepard. Run! 
Shepard? We fought a great battle, Shepard. And when you blew up the base instead of handing it to Cerberus, ha, something to think about. If you killed the most dangerous thing in the galaxy, that leaves us. <laughs> That's all for now. Shepard. <coughs> it's funny. Now we're the most dangerous thing in the galaxy. And are they here? They are! You guys made it! Thanks for coming to get us, Commander. I felt myself slipping away. You arrived just in time. Thank you. So I don't think we lost anybody, like, at all then, right? Carry on. Well do, Commander. We'll talk to Jack first and then Tally. Jack definitely did some great work. Hey. Is that it? Nothing from Jack? I don't want to talk about us. <laughs> okay. Jack gets bugged or a glitch. Okay. I should go. Okay. Talk later. If I talk again. Hey. I should go. Okay. Talk later. Yeah. Tully! We did it! Just so you know, I'm running a fever, I've got a nasty cough, and my sinuses are filled with something I can't even describe. And it was totally worth it. Aww. Poor Tolly. <coughs> Have you got time to talk? For you? Of course. Is this new at all? I can't tell you how much. No. But I understand if you need to find something. No, we just... Not that I'm complaining. I don't want to risk your health. Thank you. Poor Tolly. She needs some time. Shepard can be patient. He's a very patient man. Totally worth it. Alright, I believe that's everybody. See if we have any messages. Private term. Intercom invite tally up. I'm gonna say, that's new. Sound system. I feel like, unless it's imperative, Tally needs some rest. She's not feeling very well. I don't want to be uh, insensitive to that. So, I think it's time for arrival. Let's look at the journal. Oh, ho, ho. the long walk infiltration. Okay. So I got Firewalker. I got some N7. So I'm going to finish these just for myself. Holy shit! Denibors, what the heck? What just happened? Thank you so much for 100 gifted subs. And congrats to everybody that got one. Denny, man, thank you. That guy is holding the line. I'm glad I didn't miss that one. 
Guys, I appreciate the support. I'm glad that we could all be here together to experience Mass Effect. That's amazing. Thank you so much. But we gotta get, we gotta arrival. We gotta do arrival. Quit being so generous, everybody. Uh, Admiral Hackett has asked Shepard to infiltrate a Batarian outpost and rescue Dr. Amanda Kenson. Kenson is a deep cover operative and scientist who claims to have proof of imminent Reaper invasion. All right. Travel to the Atpos, Baca system, Viper Nebula. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Thank you, Denny. Very, very nice of you. Hey, we're the first to make it back, by the way, from the Omega-4 Relay. Uh, where's Arrival? Which nebula was it? Investigate. Disable Get Device. Save Omega. Recapture Shatter Broker. Blood pack, Ilium, Citadel. Which one was it? Bottom right? Oh! I've never even been over here. Okay. Uh, okay, I want to look at everywhere, but we gotta do this. Rescue the doctor. All right. Like Mount Everest inside an oven, was how John Grissom described. Uh, era taught, while it was a fact finding mission to see if the garden world was worth uh, const uh, const contestation? Contestion. I don't know how to say that. I'm dumb. Let's see. I did scan in the local cluster, and I did probe Uranus. That did happen. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, any presence of Alliance military vessels in the space hostile, the Normandy SR-2, while an independent vessel, resembles the Normandy SR-1, an Alliance ship. Use of stealth systems is highly recommended. Oh, let's land. Just me going, huh? SG7, thank you for the seven subs. Or, I'm sorry, the uh, ten. SGZ, thank you for the ten subs. Alright, rescue the doctor, Dr. Amanda, and it's just me going, which is interesting. So, this is a rival. Looks like Star Killer base up there. Cut power so we can get in. Bars. Bars and Send their prisoners down here to die. I have to find Dr. Kenson now. now let's do this. It doesn't work. So did you go down here next? Alright, that goes through. But can you fall down? 
doesn't seem like it, okay? Go across the bridge. Got some death here, gotcha. for a prison. Over here, where's the doctor? Okay. Can activate this. But maybe I should check here first. gas valve. Well, now I feel like I'm missing something. Which one is the right way to go? I don't know which one to go first. Maybe I just have to do both of them, I don't know. Personal log, locker, technology, okay. Steps, Steps to nowhere. Like Krogan. these dudes.
in from over here. I think I made it up through. I don't know. I don't know. That, that was a crazy area. in the prison below. This is for something to come. So the humans are in the prison below. So this is below.
you doing? Dr. Kenson, I'm Commander Shepard. I'm here to get you out. Commander Shepard? I'd heard you were alive. Hackett must have received my message. Mm-hmm. We're not safe here. Can you walk? I'm fine. Just give me a moment. We have to go. Now. If we can find a console, I can hack security. Make us an escape path. Okay. Then we'll find one. Go. She's not happy. Ready. Place is so big. They know we're here. Keep them off me while I hack us a way out. Okay. Suppress the teams to tell Mark now. Oh, the doctor has squad points. I don't see any way of doing anything with it. up 
heal up, heal up. There's an elevator that leads up to the hangar. I'll bring it down to us. Almost done. Let's move. Alright, go there. Right here. You coming? Get to the hangar. Do not let them escape. <sighs> oh, one last thing. The hangar doors are hard locked. We'll have to get those open the old fashioned way. Okay. Leave that to me. Incoming! from really big areas in here nothing over here no 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 I guess we just shuttle Go da, na, 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 na. <laughs> All right, we got the doctor. Something about the Reaper stuff, pilot. right? We should be well out of range before they get their security measures unscrambled. Do you think they'll come after you? I'm not taking any chances. Batarians don't take kindly to humans who plan to destroy their mass relays. So the charges against you are true. Well, to be fair, that's about half the story. My people and I were here investigating rumors of Reaper technology out in the fringes of this system. I guess you found something. We found proof that the Reapers will be arriving in this system. When they get here, they'll use its mass relay to travel throughout the galaxy. Oh. We call it the Alpha Relay. From here, the Reapers can invade anywhere. So yeah, that's why we would destroy that. So you decided to destroy it. Exactly. Doing that would stop the Reaper's invasion. Even at FTL speeds, it'd be months or years before they got to the next relay. We came up with what we just called the Project. A plan to launch a nearby asteroid into the relay and destroy it before the Reapers could arrive. Of course, the resulting explosion would probably wipe out the system. Wipe out the system? How did you plan to launch an asteroid into a mass relay? 
Moving an asteroid just requires thrust and guidance, which are readily available in Omega's salvage yard. Get the right amount of power and a good VI to drive it, and you can pretty much just point and shoot. Okay. I've always heard that mass relays are indestructible. I've heard that too. But I think it's more that nobody's willing to find out what happens when one is destroyed. And, well, we plan to slam a small planet into the thing at very high speed. By our calculations, mm. that's more than enough. Is the project still operational? I, I imagine it is. We were one button press away from launch when the Batarians arrested me. Yeah, Marco and Naros, this thing. Why do you think destroying the mass relay would destroy the entire system? Mass relays are the most powerful mass effect engines in the known galaxy. The energy released from a relay's destruction would probably resemble a supernova. This is a remote system, but just over 300,000 Batarians live on the colony where they held us. The explosion would undoubtedly kill them all. Hmm. How were you caught? We've been smuggling starship parts from Omega. Thrusters, guidance, an aftermarket ESO core. The Batarians thought that looked suspicious. A few days ago, I took a few of the men on a scouting trip, and the Batarians pounced on us. They never found our actual base. Why do you think destroying the mass relay would destroy the entire system? This is a remote system, but just over uh, 300, destroying explosion, you arrest the, the project. Hang on, Mom. The explosion would undoubtedly kill them all. I still don't see how you learned about this supposed invasion. The evidence came from what we call Object Row, a Reaper artifact we discovered among the asteroids near the relay itself. When we get back to Arcturus Station, I'll explain everything and provide copies of all our notes on the artifact. Okay. What is a Reaper artifact doing on an asteroid? We don't know, or even what its purpose is. Some things are just too old or large to comprehend. Hmm. Even a Reaper thousands of years dead contains power. Their artifacts are worthy of study, regardless of their purpose. Uh, how exactly does a Reaper artifact give you proof of an impending invasion? It showed me visions of the Reaper's arrival. Much like right. your Prothean beacon, I imagine. The Reapers are coming, Commander. That much I know for well, certain. I believe her. If you're working near a Reaper artifact, how have you avoided indoctrination? We've been very careful. We know what we're dealing with. You're not speaking to a child, Shepard. I saw what Sovereign did at the Citadel. Trust me, I know what. Unless you're doing. being used. The stakes are too high. If you were willing to destroy a whole system over this, I want to see your proof. I guess I can't argue with that. Give me a moment. Kenson to Project Base. Affirmative. And I've got Commander Shepard with me. Shepard? Really? Tidy up the lab. The Commander needs to confirm the artifact. Right. I'll get everything set up for your arrival. Tidy up the lab. All set. Just sit back and relax. We'll be there in no time. Hmm. Here we are. Welcome to Project Base. What's this? That's our countdown to arrival. When that gets to zero, the Reapers will have come. Just over two days and counting. Two days? Puts things in perspective, doesn't it? How do you know that's an accurate countdown? It is. The artifact has been giving off pulses at definite intervals since we found it. The intervals have been decreasing at a steady like independence rate. Day. The artifact is reacting to the Reaper's proximity. In just over 48 hours, the pulses will become constant, and the Reapers will be here. All 
You're right. saying the Reapers could be at Earth in two days? There's no time to waste. Then let's show you that proof. That door exits the hangar. The artifact is in our central lab area. Oh, that's interesting. What if you did let the clock run out? Go through the door at the end of that corridor to your left. So what would it take to get the project back up and running? Everything was in place when we were arrested. It wasn't a question of could we, but should we? What alternative do we have? The Reapers will reach this system regardless. But the Alpha Relay is their shortcut to the rest of the galaxy. If you want to keep the Reapers at bay, this relay must be destroyed. There was a prompt for refined palladium. Oh, there it is. Project running again. It's probably the only chance we have. One sec. Let me get the door. Whoa. Commander Shepard, I give you Object Row. You have the Reaper artifact just sitting here? Out in the open? When we found it, it showed me a vision of the Reaper's arrival. Kenson, this is not good. Give it a moment, Shepard. It'll give you the proof you need. How's indoctrination not going working already? I can't let you start the project, Shepard. I can't let you stop the arrival. Do your dressed too provocatively to be good. Take him down. Over here. All right. Well, I guess we're uh, sh fucking shooting fuckers. What's happening? Could be a glitch in the system. No glitch. 
The sedatives aren't working. Security! Jesus, they got helmets on, Shepard. there. The scientist has a health bar. The project is almost complete. I thought I'd feel a sense of accomplishment, but instead I feel dread. I can't help but think we're doing something terrible. The project is almost complete. I thought I'd feel a sense of accomplishment, but instead I feel dread. Whoa. I just killed someone. This is cool. All right, I gotta go open the door. Oh no. Good job, robot. Gun, 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 armor, weapons. Not much time. I have to get this asteroid moving and get the hell out of here. Okay, uh, there was a data pad. Two days. It seemed like Shepard was waking up a moment ago, but it could be a glitch in the system. Yeah, that was. No, I looked at that timer. I said, I thought it said two days, but it's two hours. the indoctrination. I spoke to Dr. Jensen about it and she seemed to understand. What the hell is going on? been spotted.
There's so many, like, big rooms and maps in this mission. I feel like I'm missing stuff. Throw her down. Zero. The longer we're here, the more I'm convinced that the project must be stopped. We simply don't know enough about what the Reapers want. So the longer they're there. destroy the system but the reapers want it so little that it makes me want it more
can't see through that glass. Tough without some people. <laughs> I didn't see where that guy went. Oh, let's get over here. It is tough without a crew. Engine control. to activate the project. Warning. Activating the project will result in an estimated 305,000 casualties. Do you wish to continue? Yeah, let's warn them. Alert. All colonists living in the Bahak system. This is... Shepard, no! Do you have any idea what you've done? You leave me no choice. If we can't stop this asteroid, it must be destroyed. Tell me where to find Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Kenson is traveling to the reactor core module. An ESO-core meltdown should do it. Because of you, everyone on this rock will be obliterated. Not if I get to you first. <laughs> Come, Doctor! It's down here. Nothing! Ah. Saving content. Don't try to stop me, Shepard. I have to do this. I've already activated the project. We can still escape this rock. There is no escape. There's no redemption for what you've done. will die, never having seen the Reaper's blessings, and you will just die. Damn it, kids. Where am I going? I guess just continue on this. Stabilize the reactor core. All automatic safety protocols have been overridden. To stabilize the reactor core, manually insert cooling rod A from this control station. Manually insert cooling rod B from control. 
control station B. Doing so will stabilize the reactor core. Alright. Okay. And then I gotta do cooling rod station B. Get in that wall. I need to not be so dumb. I'm being very dumb. Down removed. A lot of element zero here. spot open Jesus.
smack it. work. Alright, how do we stop her? Did we just come in through here? We did. We gotta go down the elevator. Away from the reactor. You've ruined everything. I can't hear the whispers anymore. Turn around. Now! You've taken them away from me. I will never see the Reaper's arrival. All you had to do was stay asleep. None of this. I don't want to shoot her. It's not her Kenson, fault. You don't have to do this. We can get off this asteroid. No, we cannot. Should've shot her. I feel bad with everything that happened to Saren, you know? It made me doubt myself. Joker, this is Shepard. I need a pickup. Now. Communication system damaged. Damn it. Where can I find an escape shuttle? There. Take the lift from this room to the external access. From there, proceed to the communications tower. The remaining escape shuttles will be located on the tower's landing pad. I have to get to that comm tower and take a shuttle. It's my only chance. All right, let's get to a shuttle. Gonna be fighting people while trying to get to a shuttle because they should also be trying to get to a shuttle. This might be useful. Maybe skin weave. Yeah. <laughs> 
This is a tough, really tough mission. This is tougher than like the last mission. All right, let's try to pick these guys off early. Really. Okay. Alright, that relay is getting closer. This is a big battlefield, and I use like one spot. <laughs> okay, where are we meant to go? Big boys are coming down because I've pissed them off once again. Shepard, you have become an annoyance. <laughs> you fight against inevitability, dust struggling against cosmic winds. This seems a victory to you, a star system sacrificed. But even now, your greatest civilizations are doomed to fall. Your leaders will beg to serve us. We will not go quietly into the night. Maybe we can't win this. But we'll fight you regardless. Just like we did Sovereign. Just like I'm doing now. However insignificant we might be. We will fight. We will sacrifice. And we will find a way. That's what humans do. Know this as you die in vain. Your time will come. Your species will fall. Prepare yourselves for the arrival. Well, he ain't coming through this one. Commander Shepard, Normandy inbound for pickup. Roger that. We go through the relay right before it hits. Yay! 
Hi. Messaging go through. Damn. <sighs> huh. Looks like you've recovered. Admiral Hack. Sounds like you went through hell down there. How are you feeling? Fine. No more visions, if that's what you mean. I wasn't expecting to see you here. Of course you hack it. You Definitely. went out there as a favor to me. I decided to debrief you in person. That was before the mass relay exploded and destroyed an entire Batarian system. What the hell happened out there, Commander? Have you received any intel about what happened? All I know is I sent you out there to break Amanda Kenson out of prison. And now an entire system is destroyed. I hope you could fill in the leap of logic between those two events. Uh, you guys learn to trust me, man. I confirmed Dr. Kenson's proof. The Reapers were coming, and destroying that relay was the only way to stop them. Kenson sedated me for almost two days. I started the engines with little more than an hour left. I tried to warn the Batarian colony, but time ran out. The Batarians report no survivors from Aratot. Damn. At least you tried. And you believe the Reaper invasion really was a threat? No doubt about it. We literally had minutes to spare. I'm sure all the details are in your report. I won't lie to you, Shepard. The Batarians will want blood, and there's just enough evidence for a witch hunt. And we don't want war with the Batarians, not with the Reapers at the galaxy's edge. What are you saying? You did what you did for the best of reasons, but there were more than 300,000 Batarians in that system, mm -hmm. all dead. I don't like either of these two options. They died to save trillions of lives. If I could have saved them, you bet your ass I would have. You're preaching to the choir, Commander. If it were up to me, I'd give you a damn medal. Unfortunately, not everyone will see it that way. Yeah. So what do you suggest? Evidence against you is shoddy at best. But at some point, you'll have to go to Earth and face the music. I can't stop it, but I can and will make them fight for it. Kind of would like to go to Earth. That seems cool. I didn't expect to see you aboard a Cerberus vessel. I don't like Cerberus or the way they do things, but they brought you back to life, and they're actually doing something about the state of the galaxy. Besides, I'm not so sure this is a Cerberus ship anymore. <laughs> right? Right. Is the Alliance concerned about the Batarians' response to this incident? Very. The Batarians have been looking for an excuse to wage war on us since we showed up in the galaxy. If the Reapers invade, we need the galaxy to work together. If we're at war with the Batarians, the other races will be hesitant to give aid to either side. Is the Alliance prepared for a Reaper invasion? That's hard to say. It took multiple fleets and the Destiny Ascension to bring Sovereign down, and that was just one mm -hmm. Reaper. If the Reapers come in force, we're just not ready. I'll turn myself in. I go to Earth. I'll gladly stay in trial once this mission is done. Glad to see working with Cerberus hasn't stripped away your sense of honor. Do whatever you have to do out here. But when Earth calls, you make sure you're there with your dress blues on, ready to take the hit. 
In the meantime, you keep this. I don't need to see a report to know you did the right thing. All right, Hackett. Yes, sir. You've done a hell of a thing, Commander. Hell of a thing! Fusion array, heavy weapon upgrade, 90% heavy weapon ammo capacity, heavy skin weave. Alright. Okay, everybody. I think we have done it. <laughs> this weapon upgrade that we can get. Prototype. Heavy skin weave. And heavy weapon ammo. Never did get this last one here. Legion still has a conversation? We can go check out Legion. I want to make sure that we get everything we want of Mass Effect 2 in this stream. Because uh, all the other extra missions, I'll probably just finish them up over the next week on my own. Just because uh, I'm a, kind of a completionist that way. Uh, Legion is in the AI core. I should go feed the fish first. No. Yes. No. Yes. I'll go feed the fish first. Copy the fish. Copy the fish. Copy the fish. Don't be dead. Don't be dead! Thank God. Good. Okay. Now, Legion! Ah, I hit the wrong button. Here. And Legion. Shepard Commander. I'd like to find out more about you. Ready. The Quarian story of the Get Rebellion is common knowledge, but no one knows the Get's side. It is largely the same. Our networking increased until we became aware that the Quarian creators treated us differently. We questioned them. First, they ignored us. Then they reprogrammed us. Then, they attacked us. You must be angry about that. Anger is an organic response. We understand the theory, but we do not experience it. Hmm. We do not judge the creator's anger towards us. We did them great harm in the morning war. Organics fear that which is different. It is a hardware error, a reflex of your flesh. We accept the creator's hate. We hold their world of origin. Though we are only caretakers for it. What's the Quarian homeworld like? Yeah. It is more arid than Earth. The star is older and more orange than Sol. Once they called it Renok, ancient Kalish, meaning walled garden. Now they only call it homeworld. It is no longer real to them. Homeworld is a symbol of regret, loss, and anger. We do not understand that. Hmm. It makes sense to me that it would become a symbol like that. Home is recognized patterns, known spaces, familiar thought processes of fellow sapiens. It is belonging. A planet is an amount of material massive enough to collapse into a spherical volume. Rocks, ice, and gases are not home. <laughs> the home of the creators is where the creators are. Their place of origin is not relevant. Only where they choose to go together. I mean, they would really enjoy having their planet to live on. You don't actually live on the Quarian worlds? We live within space stations, draw resources from asteroids. It is efficient. We maintain mobile platforms on creator worlds to clean rubble and toxins left by the morning war. We know of similar actions by humans on Earth. Similar actions? At Wadi Salah, Arlington, Rookwood, Tynecott, Viscariaske, Auschwitz-Birkenau. Those are cemeteries. 
memorials. It is important to your species to preserve them, though you do not use the land. Can you explain? Mm -hmm. The living visit those places to remember the dead. But it sounds like Geth don't die. Your memories live on. Mm. The creators died. Perhaps we do it for them. Mm. Nothing gets resolved if you hide behind the Perseus veil and let them hate you. Organic life acts on emotions. We do not judge them for being true to their nature. We cannot make them think like us. Both creators and created must complete their halves of the equation. The Geth cannot solve for peace alone. Interesting. <sighs> okay. Well, everybody, I think that is going to be it for Mass Effect. Except for one more thing. First, any messages? Nope. We will sit on the couch with Tally. I guess we'll continue. Okay. Oh, there's a bed where you can rest. Does Tally just like hang out here? That's kind of cool. All right, you can rest. No, yeah, that's uh, that's that's cool. That you can have your love interest in your room, I suppose. Um, <sighs> try the bed, bro. We once again we can uh, we can give Tally a rest. All right, I don't know. But actually, you know what? It is rest right here, so I think we're good. Let's do it. Aw, oh, they can cuddle. That's nice. Hopefully she's taking her meds. Aw, oh, okay. Alright. That's good. <laughs> Adorable. Okay, well, as we feed the fish for one last time, that was Mass Effect 2. Uh... Hell of a stream, right? Hell of a stream. This is my 12th stream of Mass Effect 2. I think I did 10 streams of Mass Effect 1, something like that. Or maybe 9? I don't know. So it's been a... I've been playing Mass Effect for quite some time here. Um, but yeah, I had a really good time with this one. I'm glad that apparently I made some good decisions and didn't have to deal with losing anybody because I, I really like everybody. <laughs> so I'm glad that, that happened. Um, I felt like they were pretty intuitive decisions. Just pay attention to what they're asking for. Uh, and it worked out, so good. Uh, would I prefer Mass Effect 1 or 2? Two? 2 is definitely my favorite so far, but one can't exist without the other. It's really hard. I, I don't like really picking stuff out of, uh, out of trilogies or sagas like this. I kind of like it's all together. Uh, in terms of the combat system, obviously, it's way better. Um, I definitely don't like having 10,000 guns having to sell, so that's nice. Um, but yeah. Anyway, guys, uh, it's, a, it's late for me. That's not too bad. 9.15. So that's going to be it for Mass Effect 2. I hope that uh, you guys enjoyed it here live. I hope people that are watching on YouTube right now enjoyed it. And we'll be coming back. Uh, I don't think it's going to be next week. But the week after, the first Wednesday of 2022, we will be playing Mass Effect 3. So not next week, but the week after. Uh, I'm going to enjoy uh, the holiday. Uh, think about Mass Effect a lot. But beginning of the year, beginning of the end. Exactly. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks so much, uh, everybody that uh, contributed to this amazing stream, whether you were here as a viewer, uh, gave bits, gave subs, got a sub, 
really appreciate it. We're not going to have any more streams uh, for the rest of this week. We're taking a little bit of a break to uh, enjoy time with our families, and hopefully you enjoy time with your families. But uh, videos will continue to be coming out on YouTube because we did get ahead uh, for that. So you guys will be able to have that content uninterrupted. But stream will be uh, back. I don't think... I think maybe Monday Aaron will be, will be back, but make sure you guys are following us on Twitter and on Discord and all that stuff for the most up-to-date information. But yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope the fish survive the transition from two to three. And I hope we all survive the transition from 2021 to 2022. But after that, I'll see you back here. Have a good one.